So let me give you an equation to illustrate uh, an equation. Sorry for talking fast. Let me give you an equation to illustrate exactly what temptation is. So you can pause the audio right now and take a pen and paper if you like, but it's not something that is very big. I think that you, you will understand it. So temptation equation is environment, open bracket, hook, close bracket, plus senses, open bracket, emotions, close bracket, equals to temptation, open bracket, demand, close bracket. And let me repeat that. So temptation is is not an independent thing. For it to occur, you have to be in a particular environment. And in that environment, there has to be a hook. And a hook is something that draws you towards it, that make you want it and need it in that particular time. And the way that it communicates with you is through the senses. And your senses will evoke emotions. So let's say that your senses are, are touch. Someone is touching you in a particular way and you're feeling it. Uh, maybe someone is saying something sexy uh, and you know it, it's evoking particular emotions causing arousal and now you're tempted. And basically temptation is demand and your response is the supply to it. And in order for you to break this equation, you have to remove either one. You can remove yourself from the environment or you can remove your senses. And the way that you usually do that uh, is basically removing yourself from the situation. Let me give you an example. So let's say that I, I, I am tempted to commit adultery through seeing I'm walking at the street and I see this young lovely lady and my mind, you know, two sides start popping images in my head. What I have to do is that I have to close my eyes or look the other way and walk fast. Sometimes it's good to be blind. 